All right, all right, all right, let's go again. Let's go now. Okay. Here we are. Here we are, we're back now. We're back with good sound, we're back with good music, and we're back with Warframe for a long time. We're back with a game again, we're back with an update, an update which I actually think is rather good. Now before we get into that, let me just say, um, we've had like audio issues for like a couple streams in a row. Um, I can never hear my own stream as it comes out because otherwise you will get feedback. So like, let me tell you something right now. Um, if you're early, if you're ever early on the stream, you see like this countdown screen, like this thing right here. If you see this, okay, there is always music with that. If you do not hear music, if you do not hear music while you see that screen, tell me. Because there's always going to be music with that. If there's no music with that, that means like the, the audio doesn't work. But there's always music with that. Always, 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 always. So, let me know whenever, like, whenever that happens and there's no music with it, like, tell me. Um, because, like, then something's wrong. But anyway, with that out of the way, let's get into the update. Because, goddamn, is it a good update? <laughs> it's been a while since I've been like, oh my god, since I've been happy with Warframe. I wasn't so prepared to be as excited about this new update as, like, like I, I just don't know. I just wasn't prepared. I wasn't mentally prepared. I wasn't physically prepared. I don't know how or what this happened, but Heart of Demos. It's quite something. Steph, I don't know if you played it. I don't know if you played the quest. I don't know if anyone of you have played the quest yet, but uh, let's go uh, Let's go ahead and do it. Um, I'm just going to go and um, plug in my computer because I actually have my, play I have my PlayStation plugged in right now. Um, I'm downloading the update file right now to see if we can, like, maybe we want to, like, play the quest and I can play it on PlayStation because uh, I've already played on PC. The video is going to be out, like, in two days' time. Uh, Terraria video is live now, though. So, uh, yeah, that is, that's what's going to be happening. Also, Steph, how's it going, man? How are you doing? How are you doing today? I hope you're doing, I hope you're doing fine. Let me go and plug in my computer and uh, so we can get started with the game. <laughs> oh, man, oh, man, oh, man. Boom. Here we go. The computer should be turning on right now. Let's see if we get a feed. There we go. We got a feed. Let me make sure that I have the audio set up for the game. Um... I might have to like restart the game real quickly or reopen settings. Me, uh, me looking like, yeah, but I don't know about anything. Totally not grinding, standing for second rank. <laughs> you're not grinding? You're not grinding? I don't believe it. I do not believe it for one single second. You're not grinding, man. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Oh. It's good. It's good. We're going to talk about it. We're going we're gonna to take a look at many, many different aspects of this thing. Um... Uh, I'm gonna have to restart real quickly because it doesn't pick up my new capture card and it just went into windowed mode Which is absolutely horrible. I hate windowed mode. So uh, while I'm fixing the game dude, how's it going man? How is this day? Actually like I am literally just coming out of like video editing stuff literally just posted the video um, And before that was a lot of like uh, Recording for like the quest. The quest is long by the way for those of you who haven't played it yet I'm not I'm not gonna spoil it yet. So you know you're kind of free with spoilers also, I think Twitch Drop should be enabled. I'm not quite sure. I should actually take a look at this um, to see whether I have things properly set up. Because then, um, like, um, create a dashboard. Let me take a look if things are properly uh, uh, connected. Uh, let's see. We are only two. Uh, what do you mean, only two? Uh, let's see. Let me hold, hit a play right here. Let's see. Extensions drops. Drops right here. Drops are enabled. Um, drops are enabled. Uh, link. Hold on. Link. Warframe. Oh, I should just do like warframe.com slash login. Let me very quickly log in on here. It's only active if your account is linked to Twitch. Yeah, um, I just need to like very quickly see whether my account is actually linked to Twitch. Because it's been a while since um, since there's been like a drops campaign that I really like fully cared about. Um, uh, hold on. Here we go. Sign in. Oh, come on, website. You can do it. Here we go. Boom. Uh, confirmed on my robot. Also, I'd kind of like something a little, 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 little less energetic. This is a rape. Not bad. Um, 
So let's see, sign in with this thing. Uh, one drop is after 20 minutes, and I have bad luck. Don't worry about it. I'm, uh, I'm, 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 I'm fixing it up for you. I'm fixing it up. I, we're, we're gonna get the best drops here ever. Um, let's see. It's linked to Michelle Postma, so the Twitch thing should work. Um, so then if I go in here... I think I have audio now, so that's good. We got audio. Sweet. Let me get the, um, the picture shot properly, and then we can get started. Uh, display. Never, never, ever have it unwindowed. That is so dumb. There we go. Full screen. Full screen is where it's at. All right, let's get into this. Let's get into this. Um. Woo! Oh, boy. Oh, boy, is it bright outside. There we go. That's better. So, we here in Warframe. Uh, I'm here with Nidus, because what outer frame can you play as while playing with a... Uh, with an infested, infested world. Um, let me get everything set up properly, cause like literally it's all like on like the, in the brink of time. <laughs> okay, so we're set up to have this. We set up to have that. Um, I should probably reload this page for a second, see whether, whether it officially says that we have drops enabled. I think it will be. I don't think there is like much else to go on. Um, remember that one time when like drops were like based on achievements? Like that was a crazy time. Anyway, um, let me get some gameplay here. Question, have you ever played the video, the, on video, the first quest? Just a serious question. I have not played the, um, um, the Awakening yet. I've not played the original quest. What I'm curious about, actually, is whether Force Prize just kind of stays in here. My queen, you were right, the Ten of Fred is real. We found one drifting near Pluto. So you cannot replay this anymore, but like it still stays in here. I wonder if with new players, like this quest is still in there or whether it's just like, it's no longer in there because they've never played it. And this is now some sort of like exclusive pot, like, like shown thing like, oh, you were there when like the original thing was here. This right here, Awakening, I have never played, but it says I've completed it. Tenno, monuments of an ancient warrior cast for generations you've slept with no cult to wake you until now. Um, so I've not played it. Um, I'm thinking I might do like a playthrough on the, um, on the, what is it? On the, like, for, for a video. Force Prize just starts after. Really? Really? So Force Prize is still a thing that happens? Oh my god, I did not know that. That is surprising. I thought they would replace it. That's pretty cool. So, uh, yeah. Heart of Dam is right here. We've completed it. Or I've completed it. Um, let's, uh, let's get right into there. Um... Let's see. Don't know. I think so. Um, I'll, I'll, be, I'll be, I'll be, like doing a video about it soon, I guess, because I think it's a, it's a fun quest to play through. Um, and this, this update has really, really like surprised me in a good way. So let's go to, let's go to demos. Um, let's go to this bloody place out here. Um, and let's go take a look at, as to like what we can do. Actually, I have never played one of these missions. I'm really curious, as to, like, what these missions will bring. What do we have here? Target, Sealer Prelate, and we have an assassination of Lephantis. Oh, wait! Are these, like... Is this, like, the... Hold on. Does the Orc and Derelict still exist? Or did the Orc and Derelict just get moved to Deimos? Is that what happened? It's a Derelict? Okay. Replaying the full quest is impossible, however. You can only do the first mission. What is up, Afima? How are you doing? <laughs> I, I like I might actually I might actually go and um, uh, do the do the quest again because I do have my PlayStation 4 which is updating right now, um, and I think that I should be able to do that on my PlayStation 4 because I have passed Mars, um, so I should be able to do it on the PS4. But let's first get into like the the thing right here. Obviously, you should always go to uh, to Instant 69. If you do anything else, you are banned from this channel. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, how's it going, Afima? How is everything today with you? I hope you're fine. I hope you're good. Uh, I'm really excited. This, this, uh, this update. I'm like, I'm almost so conflicted uh, um, about like liking it so much. <laughs> All right, here we go. So yeah, here we are. And the heart of demos, or like demos, or whatever. Like I don't even know what everything is supposed to be called. I'm just calling heart of demos, because um, that's the name that's been given. Um, have you all played it? Have you all played the quest? Misha wants an instance of 69. <laughs> I want them memes, man. Cry, what's up, dude? How's it going? Have you all played? Have you all played the quest? 
Are we fine? We're talking about things. I need to. I need to be certain. I need to be certain. I, I want to. I want to know how you guys stand on it because it, it's been out for like a day almost, uh, like 22 hours or something. I know some people have like jump on the jump on it right when it comes out. I know some people like wait a little bit longer. Um, so let me know. Let me know. Let me know where where you at, guys? Where you guys at with the quest? I've done it. Crowd's done it. I think Steph, you've done it too. Have you? And a female like like I, I'm getting the impression from you guys that you, you that you've all done it. Um, let me know if that's the case or if it's not the case. Um, I can't speak for all the audience, but uh, for me, no. <laughs> Sarcasm over 9,000. All right, whatever. We're just going to say hi to the mother. What is up, mother? How's it going? My son will never Ooh. complain to you. He thinks I was too strict with him. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, man. So what were your first thoughts? What What were your first impressions of this quest? Tell me. What did you think? I'm going to I'm gonna start up a bounty, and I'm going to tell you <laughs> all I think. Because, oh, boy. Oh, boy. There's so much going on here. Um... Let's see. We can just like start off with something uh, with something strong right here. So First impressions, Let's yeah. What, what do you take mean? away from it? Because for me, Over like, years, many um, and have let's see what they say. By the way, caches of resources left behind by the survivors still dot the surface. See what you can find and bring back. All right, or here we go. Show you where to look. I haven't heard these. Uh, I haven't heard these. Uh, these these, these uh, um, intermissions yet. So I'm kind of like curious to hear. Um, the thing that I was so surprised by is two things. First of all, we're gonna see as we come in here. Guns get the flammable and call space marines. We need exterminators here five minutes ago. <laughs> oh yeah, definitely, dude. I get such a like, oh, I get such an like, oh, such a what's it called? Like, I want to clean this place up. I really want to fucking clean it up, uh, because it's like it looks so. It looks so right, and that's like the first thing. It's like the environment is so well made. This does not feel like an open world. Like sometimes, sometimes you kind of like realize, like, oh shit, this is like, um, this is like, like an open world. Like, like you, you realize, like, oh shit, like here these fruits and stuff. Like this is kind of like the open world thing, and like there's a cave on the map, and that's kind of like Fortuna, but it does not feel like an open world because the scenery feels so nice. Uh, I think, like, design-wise, like, this game has done a really good job. Like, this update. Also, the distances. Um, this is the first bounty I'm doing, so, like, I can't speak that much. But for the quests and stuff, the distances are done so well. Like, I have never felt, like, the feeling to, um... I have never felt the feeling to, like, go out and, uh, like, take an arc ring or something. Because everything was just, like, walking distance. And that makes this world feel, like, so much alive. Um... But more importantly, more importantly than that, is like, Planes of Eidolon did not have a quest at all. Um, Fortuna also, like, oh, Fortuna had a quest, which was kind of good, but like, you know, it was still like an open world quest, so like, it wasn't really high-end level quest. This quest, fuck me, it was, like, I played, I don't, I don't know how long you guys played it, I played it for like 1 hour and 20 minutes, roughly, um, and oh my god, it is so crazy. Like, seriously, I cannot believe it. Um, like, there is content basically throughout the you know, entire one hour and 20 minutes. It is not like um, real jack bullshit levels where it's like, oh yeah, you just gotta like stand watch here, do mobile defense here for like five minutes of like the entire quest. Like, like five minutes for every part. Like, no, this is actually one hour and 20 minutes of content. The story was compelling. And like, seriously, like, I did not feel like things were rushed. I did not feel like things were like extended or dragged on. And after one hour and 20 minutes, I felt like... I hated it! I fucking hated that they that they cut it off, because, like, we are not done yet. The, like, there is nowhere near an end in sight. Like, Fortuna was kind of like, Oh, yeah, you know, we've kind of, like, solved our issues type of meme. And, um, you know, you guys can, like, continue to farm sort of shit. But this was, like, this was literally, like... <laughs> We're not done yet. There, we're like we're nowhere near inside to like complete anything. Uh, we've just like done a bit of therapy session, and I need my mecha. I fucking need like like wh where is that thing? I don't care about the broken warframe. I only care about my mecha. I saw a mecha. I want it. I fucking want it. Goddamn it. So yeah. We had Seiya's Fidgel, yeah, but Seiya's Fidgel wasn't really a, a introduction and a request to the planes. It was kind of like, oh hey, there's like a like a Warframe thing. Can I spoil on one thing? Dude, you, like, you, you can talk about it, because like we're already talking about the quest right now. So like, feel free to talk about it. I've already played it, everyone's played it. If you haven't played it, if you come and hit me here, and you haven't played it, like, let me know. Uh, and then we'll like, change things up. Uh, but yeah. I agree, this was a fairly compelling quest. Yeah. I, like, I would even argue that it's getting on par, if not like... 
I mean, like, on par, if not even a little bit better than the second dream. And, like, I, I, I'm saying that knowing how important the second dream was, but I'm saying that with two reasons. Number one, the second dream was, like, we look back at it with such nostalgia that, like, we often, like, color it in, like, a lot more spectacular than it actually was. Uh, and number two, um, this quest followed so many story beats of, like, the second dream with, like, finding a new place, um, finding a new place, um, discovering something very crucial to your existence, that thing almost taking you out in, like, a void setting, then you having to, like, sc like struggle back, then you getting, like, a new power which you've never had before, uh, then using that power to, like, fight, and then, like, like that's, that's, that's kind of it. Um, so, like, it follows many beats, but it does it way, way better. Because this time you don't ha you're like you're not guided by the hand of like Alec B or by the hand of like someone that's stepping in for like for like mommy lotus. No no no. It's actually like you're exploring this, like you, you discover something and based on the clues on a very natural progression you just like discover the world and then you just like all of a sudden get taken out and like boom there's something new, there's a new premise of something insanely good, like the mechas. And then when you like when you, um, like, when you resolve the issue, like, the problem with the second dream was once it resolves the issue, the issue is resolved. And for, like, a singular quest, that is really good. Like, stories need to be resolved. Warframe needs to do better resolving. However, however, if Warframe comes out and, like, like, I really hope that this is an introductionary part. I hope that we get more of these quests on this, on this thing. Like, that, if, they, if they do that, then, like, it's all good. If they don't do that, it's gonna be, like, terrible. Absolutely terrible. But, like, I think that this is on the path of greatness. I think that we're, like... I mean, like, I've said it before. I don't... Shouldn't get my hopes up. But then again! Then again! <laughs> it's, like... Um, if this is just, like, a first quest and, like, more quests are coming up like this, where, like, we're actually gonna see changes happen to this world, we're actually gonna see changes happen to its inhabitants, we're actually gonna see changes happen to the heart itself, that would be absolutely great. Like, then this quest opens up a door to, like, more quests like these to follow. Um, and then, like, the thing that that opens up so much, like, this entire can of worms makes it better than a story that just kind of, like, ends, you know? So, yeah. Uh, that's how I feel. Favency, what's up, dude? How's it going, man? Uh, let me know what you guys think. Uh, how did you, how did you see the quest? What do you feel about, like, uh, Heart of Demos? What are your, what are your first thoughts and impressions? Um... Like, oh, like, so, like, long story short, I'm just really impressed with, with the environment. I think the environment is on very well. It doesn't feel like open world, even though it might start feeling op open worldly just a little bit right now. Uh, I'm not, I don't know, like, I don't know how, like, where it's at in the long term. Uh, but at the same time, uh, like, the second point that I really like is, like, the story has been written very well and can be super, like, a masterpiece. Like, I wouldn't say masterpiece, but it can be done very well if they continue with the story on. But yeah. Uh, I will be on Necro uh, Mech, Michelle. We can perform transference. <laughs> When you rank up in Trial Tree Family, you get a CGI thing where they give each other names. Ooh. Ooh. Two thing your helmet take, uh, takes minimal forming till Friday to get hel helmet. Free Necromech is... Free the Necromech is locked behind a grind at least till Friday. Grind on from now non-stop. <laughs> well, I guess we're going to be playing it more. Like, uh, I haven't like done any of the bounties or any of the grinding, so like that's what we're, that's what I'm planning on doing today. I might want to redo the quest on, on PlayStation 4 if you guys want to see the quest. Like, I do have a PlayStation 4 account that hasn't played it. It's updating right now. Uh, and that's something we can do, but I'm also super down to, like, grant some, uh, grant some, uh, grant some, grant some levels. Um, let's see. Um, the ranking of the Syndicate feels substantial, um, let's see. The ranking of the Syndicate feels substantial that, because of that. I don't really know how the ranking it compares to, uh, previous, uh, things. Like, is it better? Is it the same? Uh, I haven't re really looked into it at all. Like, not at all. <laughs> so, um, let's see. On the other hand, I, I, I like this. I sit for an hour on finish and have enough for 20 coins. Give me the coins. Uh, Necromechs are part of the Necroloid mechs. Blue Demon, what's up, dude? Um, I still, like, I'm going to have to adjust the terms for a long time. Uh, as I said yesterday with the podcast with Sandy, is like, I don't know the, the proper name of, like, the Plains of Fortuna, because I always call them Plains of Fortuna, and I will never stop calling them that, because you just have, like, Plains of Fortuna, and you have Plains of Eidolon. And this place right here, I don't know what it's called, but I'm just going to call this the Heart of Deimos, even though I think the Heart of Deimos is, like, this other thing. Like, the actual, like, heart that's beating, but, like, this area, to me, is called the Heart of Deimos. Um... I don't know if I'm correcting that. I don't know if I'm not correcting that. So give, please give me a little bit of time to get used to like all different terms. Necromex and a Necroloid Nex. <laughs> what is the difference? Tell me. Um, 
I'm not crazy about the standing gains from fishing con uh, conservation and mining right now. I think those tokens are too pricey when compared to the bounty tokens. Hmm. I we should I should actually try hunting. I want to see what the what the hunting thing is like. Um. But yeah, Misha will never get used to new terms, dude. You're right. <laughs> you're right. You're absolutely right. So yeah. Um. Also, this apparently is some sort of like storyline with a uh, with a corpus. I'm not following it because like we're just like talking a lot. Uh. But like I am like this is this is curious. Like I really like I really like how they've like moved away from the Lotus with like the storylines because like the Lotus was apparent especially with the new war starting to like irritate me a lot uh, and like their overdependence on it and now like there hasn't been a Lotus interference in a long time and it's so well well done and the Necroloid uh, Merc uh, uh, Mech I, I misspelled I'll uh, I'll say uh, like I oh, I haven't even taken a look at like like the the standing structures and the bounding structures or anything like actually we should take a look at like the square in a moment. Uh, but yeah, Corti, what's up, dude? How's it going? Uh, is that my side that the screen tearing is happening? No, that's on my side. Uh, this laptop always has screen tearing issues. Um, like part of it is like on the uh, on the laptop side of things. Part of it is also like the um, what is it the um, capture card side of things. It's just something that. Like pretty often happens with Warframe. Um, yeah, there's nothing much I can do about it. Sorry. Uh, Daughter might help you with some terminology. Ooh, then I should visit So like after after this mission, we should just go, uh, like I'm gonna go out and uh, I'm gonna check with with um, with all the with all the things with all the things in the in the, in the little, little little marketplace. The Corpus and Guineer are negotiating with the Entrati for resources. Ooh, I mean that makes sense. That makes a lot of sense. By the way, does this mean that like the Orc and Derelict system is completely gone? Like, is the Orc and Derelict system no more? Um, because like I mean, I should I, I should try these missions. I hope that they've just been like moved to here. Because like I really like the aesthetic of the Orc and Derelict. I really hope that's not like gone. Okay, laptops are fun, but hey, Michelle, just chilling after morning classes. Ooh, welcome, 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 welcome. Have you played? Have you played Heart of Damas? What do you think? What do you think? What do you think? What do you think? I'm super curious. <laughs> Here we go. Although I'm not quite sure what we need to do yet. I think that we just should just be killing things. So yeah. Uh, the Derelict is now the Damas nodes. Did they change any of like the, um, of the maps? Like, are the maps still the same? Like, as long as like the tile sets are still the same, I'm completely fine. Um, because I just love these tile sets. Like, they were so well made. And like, these are fantastic too, but I, I would hate to lose those. Uh, no, she won't really. She just uses a lot of new terminology. Oh, yeah, actually, like, I had that with like, Mother for the first time. It's so weird that they don't have names yet. Um, but like I had that with like the mother for the first time, like when, when she was talking about like, oh yeah, the dad, the, the, or no, no, I think even like the droid, oh the the the, the bloody blah, the yada yada, the bloody blah, I was just like sitting there like, uh huh, uh huh, uh huh, uh huh, yeah, I don't get it. <laughs> I haven't yet, uh, though I did get a download on last night, so I can be on later today. Okay, so. Um, Let's keep up with spoilers then. Let's keep up from like discussing the quest in like any form of detail um, because I think it's rather good. I don't want it to. I don't want it to spoil for you. Are you fine if we like discuss it in like global terms? Like we're like saying like what we generally liked about it because then like we can adjust it to that. Because um, this is definitely something. Oh my god, I'm so excited to talk about. I haven't been this excited about Warframe in a long time, and it's crazy. It is crazy. This is literally the exact opposite of um, of of Real Jack. Like, I cannot believe that the same company made Railjack, like, half a year ago and thought that that was a good idea. And now they make this. Like, I cannot believe that that happened. Uh, same maps, different locations. There's a destroyed Corpus ship on the map. Oh, I'm totally fine with spoilery discussions. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, well, I just wanted to make sure, because, like, I don't want to spoil it for you. Um, that would be, like, the worst thing. Um, oh, wait, I should not activate a purifier, should I? Fuck! I can collect these. Okay. Um, so yeah, I just think that the quest was really, really good. It was very well made. Um, I do notice, however, I would be avoiding streams if I wanted fresh, uh, if I wanted fresh sticks. 
I guess there's part of it in there, but I also know that, like, people tune in to just, like, hang out. Um, and, like, I just happen to be playing Warframe today, so, like, if they just tune in and they're like, Oh, I just wanted to, like, hang out with you for, like, Terraria, or, like, I just wanted to hang out with you for someone else. Like, that kind of, like, you know. And that would have kind of sucked, you know? <laughs> so, um, anyway, um, where, 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 okay, so, like, where was I? So, um, one of the things that I feel, and I want to, like, like, one of the things that I feel is uh, I'm super excited now because this shows a lot of potential and like it's like it like I haven't seen any 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 cutbacks I, I don't think edges have been uh, have been cut or like whatever however you call it um, it feels very well done it feels very well made one hour and 20 minutes of a quest like one hour and 20 minutes which feels just like a really good quest it's like that's good it feels good um, that being said, um, it's like ah, like 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 I am so excited because like I like if I see this, and like I see how f like how much has been set up and how little has actually been done, but how satisfying it feels. I'm like if they can do this again to like to like make me happy, like 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 finish off the other story points here, then I'm I'm all in for it. But yeah, so yeah. So how was your reaction that the heart looks like a transparent liver? I was like I I, I was just kind of like. Oh, so that what the fuck's happening now? That's 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 kind of how I was. That's literally how I was when I started for the first time. After that, like <laughs> the design is funny. I didn't expect it to look like this, but hey, it looks like how it looks. Uh, how it looks, but yeah. Psychological studies have shown that uh, having things spoiled generally increases enjoyment. I can actually understand that because, like, if you watch a show for the very first time, um, like it's kind of like. You know, you're along for the ride, but you don't know much about it. Um, but once you like start understanding like what's going on, then like, then like your your enjoyment of it like means a lot more. Which also like results in like if I tell you like guys, watch out for this, watch out for that, then you, you you see that come up, and you're like, oh shit, this is the moment. That's also like why like I've been playing a lot of Ghost of Shima for before I record my part three because now I know what's important in that game because I've already like played part of it. Like I'm familiarizing myself with like the the world and such. So yeah, like. It depends. It depends on what you want, but there's definitely something that can be said for like having spoilers and creature entertainment. I think Dave was also really upset with Real Jack's release, and they really pushed hard for a much more refined release. Definitely. So, like, like, as I experienced it, like, I would eat, like, I really think this quest like was as enjoyable, if not more, than the second dream. Um, but like, I've already said that before, and like, the things that just work for me is like. The, like, oh, like, you know how Warframe quests have always been like, go from one point to the other? You know how, like, with Warframe quests, it was always like, um, um, like, okay, go to this node, like, open up this console, then go come back, and then wait for new lines, that sort of thing. This actually felt like it was a story game. This actually felt like it was going on. Like, this felt like a real, like, continuous thing. And I've not felt that with Warframe, like, before. And, like, that is so nice. I didn't even notice the open world. I didn't even notice, like, the hub area when entering the hub area. I legit did not notice when I was walking through the gates. The only reason why I noticed, the only reason why I noticed was because, like, it's at, like, mission complete. I was like, what? What the fuck's going on here? But, yeah. And here we go. We outbeat Grenier. Things of HeroQuest emo uh, emotion collection. Oh, it, it, like this. This is this is so much in line with like the HeroQuest. And like like the thing is is like, like I, I just cannot believe. I just cannot believe. Like I remember playing some Eidolon. I literally I remember playing some Eidolon. Like me thinking about like what kind of quests there would have been in playing some Eidolon to like introduce it, and how much I was expecting that, and how much that then didn't come around, and like it was nothing. And this time I was expecting nothing, and all of a sudden it's like. Oh, here you go. Like, you have the quest that you kind of wanted for Planes of Eidolon, but you just have it, like, right now, here. And I'm like, oh, man. So did you like the Metal Gear reference? Uh, which reference? I, I, I'm, I don't think I've caught that. Or, like, I may have, but I completely forgot about it. Uh, for me, my hubris, I already enjoyed in the War Within more than the Second Dream. It was, like, I can understand. Oh, my God! We have a, we have a, we have a, we have a feisty little thing right here. Um. Hold on. Oh, shit. They're, oh, so that's why they. Oh, I see. I see. I see. <laughs> oh, man. 
I was already running like, 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 why is that thing called snake? Like, it didn't really have a clear meaning to me, but I was like, well, whatever, you know, they just call it whatever they want. Uh, no, that makes sense now. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. So, yeah, I'm really curious about the content behind here. Uh, you killed the Kelvin Sib. I killed it, because why not? <laughs> it's invested. Anything in like, dude, don't you get the, don't you get, like, the entire sensation of, like, wanting to clean this place up? Because it's, like, it's so dirty. It's all infested. Alright, here we go. Oh, I ran out of ammo. Damn. Oh, shit, I'm down. How did that happen? <laughs> oh, man, oh, man, oh, man. Uh, by the way, some music still playing? I'm not hearing it. There we go. There's the music. Okay, good. It looks like Surrey Homeworld. Uh, like... I, I do need to be careful though. I do need to be careful because I know that a lot of my excitement comes from... Comes from, ho from, comes from like the idea of potential. You're infested. I can guarantee that Nidus is producing as many spores as you're killing. <laughs> yeah, that's also why I wanted to do this with Nidus. Um... Um, but yeah, like, the thing is, is that, like, this quest, like, this quest and this update so far, I, my, my main experience with this update so far has been the quest, I haven't done much else, um, like, this is my very first bounty that I'm doing, and so far, like, it's, it's not bad, uh, also I need to, like, fix my keybinds in a moment, um, where do we need to go, by the way, oh, there we go, we go to the big red bubble of fire, um, so far, my, my experience has been a quest. Like, I have had very few bugs. I don't know what it's like on console. Like, has anyone, like, I mean, Cryo, Cryo played it played on console. Cryo, how is it on Xbox? Like, is the update stable? It feels super stable to me. I haven't had crashes. It's all well and good. Um, so, one thing that I do want to be careful about, though, is that, like, I know that my, um, how the fuck do I get there? Um, my experience is, like, purely based so far of, like, oh, this thing is great, and I really hope that, like, this means that, um, oh, I think I have to go back. Um, uh, that, like, this will happen and this will happen. I do, I, like, I do fully, like, I do begin to realize that, like, if they don't release, like, a quest following up on this, like, if they kind of, like, do Fortuna this, the, this story, and they're kind of like, oh, yeah, you know, remember that story that which you once did? Um, how the fuck do you get in here? Um, and then never follow up on it, like, that could be, like, hugely disappointed. Um, but I do, like, I'm not, like, I'm not convinced they will, because, like, this was so well made, that I'm, like, I really hope that we're gonna get to see, like, development of, like, we, we find out their names, we, we find a way to, like, clear this planet and, and such like that. Like, you can't have, you can't give me such a compelling narrative. Make it so well, and then not follow up on it. So, yeah. It's very stable, it's on Xbox, I've only uh, noticed a few bugs in total. That's, that's really cool. Like that's been that's been very well done then. Alright, so let's explore this hub area. Oh man. Oh man, oh man, oh man. This has been this has been crazy. <laughs> oh I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I've been I've been like ah I've been like too hyped. I've been like too hyped so far. Um it's always because like I'm coming over like a row of like an entire like work day. I haven't I haven't had like much rest <laughs> since this morning. So uh, I'll uh, I'll just drink. I'll shut up for a bit. <sighs> All right, let's get back into it. Let's go explore the Alberia. So okay. Now. Let me explore a little bit. Uh, Blue Demon says, PS4, no crashes, free bugs so far. The quest prompt only be accessible by operator mode. Interesting. Um, and wrong dialogue being played and dialogue being skipped or repeated uh, and on the fast travel to the surface not working. Ooh. Actually, those are some pretty big bugs. <laughs> like, especially when they're like story affecting bugs, like that kind of sucks. Damn. 
Like, do you know how they're like, like, have these been fixed already? Like, do you know what their fixing is? Because, like, one thing that, like, I'm kind of curious about with their sudden release on console, like, console releases can't be very quickly, like, changed. So, um, kind of curious as to how they do that. Um, all right. Let's go explore this hub area. So, here, right here, right here we have Mother. Um, bada bing, bada boom. Let me turn up the game volume a little bit more. Let's take a look at the Entrali standing. So, we're neutral so far. Um, wait, did I not get standing? Rank up. Entrali standing. Neutral, 5,000. Um, Necroloid, I plunder. Well, we'll, we'll use them in the new war. Honestly, like, I don't even know about the new war. The new war is so weird. Because it's, it's apparently in the Codex and we've done two of the quests or something of the new war. Like, legit, I've stopped caring about new war because it's too confusing. I don't get it. I really don't get it. But I really hope that we can use it. So with Grandma! Okay, we're gonna get to Grandma in a, sec uh, in a second. We'll do that. So, let's see. We're on neutral right now. Can we go... We can't go back. It would be funny if you, like, if you could go back to, like, be worse. We have Stranger, you were sent for. You are acquaintance, one that does not regret her decision. Um, let's see, you have proven yourself to be good and faithful. Thank you, associate, friend, and family. Okay, so, uh, we have 25,000 standing that we can achieve. Uh, let's go take a look at like the different bounties, what kind of rewards there are. So, we have, I think we're being paid out in coins, which is an interesting way. Does this mean, does this mean that you like, you, you get coins and then you can trade in the coins for rewards? So that basically, like what you had previously, what you had previously with these, um, with these updates, is that like with Fortuna you got standing, and you only you have a standing cap. So like if you wanted to like farm and grind the entire day of launch, like basically the moment you got to your standing cap, like you couldn't do anymore because like there was no use to it. And now you can farm and grind like the the coins, and you can still like, I mean there's still a standing cap, but you can only like. Like, you can still like ramp up all the coins until you have enough coins for like the standing and then you can turn them in. You can turn in tokens from standing. Okay, that's cool. I hope that's by that reason because now I can just like, you can just continue to grind, grind, grind. Um, and don't have to worry about the cap. That's cool. That's sweet. Ah, uh, food. Now he's back to the head and shoulder view. I, it's the game view, man. We need to take a look at the game. If, if, if we're not playing the game, people get mad at us. You know that. Um... So yeah, let's take a look. This right here, the reward details. What do we have here? We have a uh, common credits and no Tergolope. I'm not quite sure what the Tergolopes are supposed to be. Uh, it's some probably some like the new resources. Um, body count right here. Spring loaded chamber. Repeater and Mesa Relic. We have the helmet. Okay, that's interesting. Exactly helmet. I now have to farm that thing as well. So um, here we have new mods. Sweet. What we do have here? We have foam residue, Saku systems. Um, uh, let's see what do we have here. Here's the chassis on there. Oh, is this a new weapon? I think. Oh, it's a war fan. I like war fans. Okay. There's five different coins. The brother and grandma have the highest value, but the mother is the easiest to get. Okay. Um, and this right here is a no expiry. And uh, find and enter the isol an isolation fold. Ooh. I'm just I'm just checking around. So, um, by the way, like how well can you hear it? It's kind of low for me, so I'm gonna turn the volume just a little bit. There we go. All right, let's see here. Let's check in with a daughter right here. Um, the daughter does the fishing things. So, let's see what she has to say. She yeah, she used a lot of terminology. You see, you guys said. So let's see you here. You can't just chuck a spear in the exocrine and hope for the best. Not well, in demos. Why don't we You've try it? Isolation Fall gives you rewards to level up the Necromark Syndicate. Lures, I am not even familiar with that, so I'm gonna have to check it out. Exocrine assignment. So let's see. Balance population stock. There's many specimens in one area, even too many. What is this? Oh, is this like? Is this if I kill enemies? And I get their resources? Or like... Oh no, this is with fishing. So if I fish, that could turn them in for daughter tokens. Okay. Interesting. Uh, browse wares. A spare. Spari spare. We have another weapon right here. Okay. Until next time. Okay, that was a daughter right there. You change fish parts for tokens. Okay. 
that makes uh, that makes sense. Right here we have the sun with the animals. What is up, dude? My family may choose to live in witless denial of our condition, but I accept it. Brother is in conservation. Deimos is my mistress. Okay. Whether I chose her or not, her bitter kisses fester in my veins. Witness, Tenno. We are truly become one flesh. I crave to understand her for myself. Whatever you need to provide me samples of her processes and function, wildlife, I will provide. But if I am to understand them, I require them intact. Okay. You Spares of Destruction 2, Electric I Boogaloo. Retrieval. I actually you use my, uh, my, uh, like, destructive fishing spare for, uh, for the thing. Oh my god. Okay, capture Deimos wildlife. What kind of things we have here? So these are like if you if you catch As them, you that makes sense. You'll notice the life forms of Deimos are constantly ripping chunks out of one another. If you happen across a predicite or a vulpophila that's been wounded by the infested, what? you have a chance to save it. Just trank it quickly before it succumbs. Use as many shots as you need. Once it's recovered, you can raise it as a loyal companion. Oh my god. I'll even be able to redirect some of its infested mutations into a more useful form. Interesting. So you can also go ocean, go ahead and perhaps. then like well, cap the rescue some that? animals and then Okay. What do we have here? We have guild, um, release and entitled. Alright. So that's all that he does. Um it's okay, so basically like I mean like the the elements are still sort of the same. Um, now let's see what else we have. Uh, right here, I think we're gonna go this way. What do we have here? Who do we have here? Father. Which Father is like away? the most far gone to the infestation. Just look at me. So now I'm doing things my way, like I should have done all along. Yay! The new we'll interesting compare. I don't even know how to look like, so I'm really curious. You and me. Make them sit up and pay attention. The weapons, they're just one branch of the project. You keep on like this, and I might cut you in on more of what I've really been working on. Well, we'll get infested get guns later, about. according to the E. Interesting. Had a case of it already, didn't you? So, like, this is the thing, like, this thing, this feels so different from, like, like, this feels so different from, from like, any previous things, and then sometimes you realize, like, oh shit, it's still an open world. Like, this just feel, like, like, when I was going through here, it felt like an like an like a story you know it felt like a story game and then, and then like you come across oh yeah it's still like an open world but it feels so good that later sounds like one year later yeah more or less i wouldn't i wouldn't like count on that part requisition so oh shit we can get a fodder token we can get two fodder tokens right here two fodder tokens Five fodder tokens, fodder token, two tokens. Purchase. Interesting. Now, can we buy more? I don't think so. I like this idea of the token system. Like, I know it's it's gonna like cut down on your resources a lot, but it's a it's a it's a great way to like do the to like get your sounding. I guess you Remember the infested Cuba and the Kifat? They appear on the area you track you and you, you send them I'm to sure. the sun to domesticate. Ooh. Like, I don't, I don't know how, how they look yet because, like, I haven't seen them much yet. So, like, I haven't seen anything but, like, part of Ten of Life and I don't remember much about that. So, a lot of this is still, like, a super surprise for me. Mining isn't my only interest. I'm also so, here we have the droid. Um, like, I really like the droid. He does remind me a lot of Claptrap, though, which is, like, a little bit. <laughs> but still, he's really fun. So extraction expeditions. This is basically again like like it's so cool. You don't have to go out from things. You can just like grab grab everything and then like you know um, trade it in for sounding. That is super nice. Uh, I will embark at the state of lurking. I apologize. A hostile wariness seeks to uh, seeks to tame, but uh, equally I have dreams in queue. There is a silly, folly soul I rode. Dance with me, corpse, in ecstasy. Until the moon fades, until in the light becomes stray, and our minds are free to play. Dance with me, corpse, belovingly. Till the night fades to black, till our souls 
that we lack falls apart from the stack. Dance with me, corpse, so deadly until the light breaks this, um, the glass, till our forms become ash and leave the hands beyond us to bash. <laughs> Alright, that is, like, again, one of your beautiful, beautiful, beautiful um, ratings. Uh, but yeah, um, go do what you have to do, uh, Fimea. Thank you so much for tuning in. I really appreciate it. So let's check out what grandmother right here. Her first duty was to have family, not to some fatuous dream. If I were her mother... Oh, I'm sorry, dear. So let's see, trade tokens. On, dear. We have 90 tokens. We can give that for 100 standing, and we have 100. So 100, it's all 100, basically. Oh shit, I'm pretty much at like... Wait, hold on. How does that make sense? No, hold on. That says, that's, that says it does 100 standing. That says it does 100 standing. Why is this different? How does this make sense? Let's see, I've put in like... Oh no, I've put in 5,000. I've put in 50. Oh yeah, I've put in 50. I was like 90. How does that make sense? No, it works. The math checks out. May you have much joy of it. Mm. So you didn't know the wall's door is like Unko's cave? Oh, hold on. I'll be right here. I have not checked up. this out yet, so... Um, the wall door. Where is that one? Father right here. Is that this one here? Mother. Oh, hold on. I need to... And Trouty's standing. I need to see if we can rank I up. I need dialogue. spinal core section. Found in fish. Okay, so I need to hunt these fish. I need to start fishing to uh, rank up. Until our next appointment. So let's see. Um, all right, we need to go back around because I think that wall is right there. So let's take a look. Or isn't it this way? Um, doesn't seem like it. Mm -mm, this is a little empty space. I'm getting more and more feel for this place. That's good. What's this way? There's his father right here. This mother. Oh, right here. I found it. Woo! Because if you go with your Warframe, you can't go in. Okay, found it. Woo! All right, what do we have here? It's gonna be the amps, of course. Oh, they're writing on the wall. Scenery again is so beautiful. Oh, so this is the library. Oh yeah, I think I, I think I remember. I've seen this before. And here we have Lloyd. These days, we never receive visitors. All right, Necroloid standing. Let's go take a look. What do we have here? A um, few offerings. So we have... Oh, so this is the way we can build it. Necromech. Oh, shit. I want to make... Oh, I want to make them so bad. I want to make them so bad. I trust this does not preclude the future dealings. So rank up. You have to be... I think you have to be rank three. Um, trade orc and matrices. Spatial orientation matrix to aid with max guidance, balance, and movement. How do you get those? Where did I get them from? Are you getting those from like fighting these mechs? Well, yeah, I need to. I need to get my standing up for here. Okay, there is so much new. There is so much new. It's so cool. Also, this environment, I love it. All right, let's go back. Let's get out of here. Um, Necromech drop and fold opening. Okay, so I think we should go out to actually like let's see the let's see what the fold thing is. Cause I haven't I've not done any of that. I don't like well I don't remember seeing that. I don't know what it means. So let's try that. Bounties. Let's do a full thing. I don't know what it is, but we'll see. Much has been hidden from us on Demos. 
The old ruins beneath the surface must surely contain the deepest and darkest secrets. Oh wait, the fold is like the the thing down below. Oh okay, 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 hold on. See what's happening down there. Tell me what he has been up to. All right, let's see. Let's enter the can 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 be on the heart of Demos. We're entering the heart of Demos. <laughs> Mika, what is up? How's it going? How are you doing? So good to see you, man. Have you have you played a little bit of Heart of Demos already? When in stories return from the void, if so, how are you liking it? If not, um, I hope I don't, I'm not going to spoil too much. Technology useful against the infestation. Um, you stay out, Tenno. There's only death and decay down there. Hey, Alright, collect like worm residue. Maybe worm babe found. Alright, let's go there. Is this the babe? Yeah, I think it is. Boom residue. Interesting. Like, I'm not quite like, 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 I know that they make all these references to, like, the Requiem mods. And, like, there's some lore behind it. I'm really not caught up on the lore all that much yet. But I'm like, on the one hand, I'm kind of like, it's weird because like, not knowing many things. On the other hand, I really enjoyed like this sense of like childish awe that like you have, like you always have with like a new update. And I'm just gonna like relish in it. Yeah, um, yeah, I tried it. The lore is very interesting. The fun factor still can't tell. Well, I like, did you, like, did you complete the quest? Because I think that, like, the quest has been really, really good. Um, playing these bounties right now, um, there is a lot of these, the, the, like, the, um, uh, the environment still feels very good. The enemies still feel rather new, even though, like, I really, like, mashed them around and I don't really notice the difference between them, to be honest. Because, like, literally, it's like... I don't have a good time to look at them because they're dead before I can take a good look at them. Um, but I can see like already bits of like Warframe's open world system come here through. It's like the bounties are still rather the same. Like things are very, very similar as they were before. Um, but they're in a code which like re hides it really well. And I like it. If you find a pillar, um, a pillar with a simple shot uh, with the amp. So one of these pillars that we just had, you, need, you gotta amp that? Where was that? I've lost my track in the ring. Oh, there it was, that thing. Ooh! Interesting. I don't know what it does, but it did something. <laughs> oh boy, there's so many things that I don't know about. Ooh! Damn! Also, these caves, by the way, like, look at these caves. Like, they're just like the cave system in the, in the, what is it? Take concoction. They're just like the, um, throw bait at door. Oh. And it's not like we have to go to it. Yeah, finish the quest. I don't know if we have to have the energy to max the syndicates. Yeah, I mean, like that. Ah, it's open. The the, the bot hole's open. Um, like this is my first time getting it for with the bounties. I think it's a long quest, so you're like, I, I would also not be able to just like jump straight into the syndicates right after. Um, but yeah, I really enjoyed the quest. And after that, I was like, I did I did have to like take a break just to be like, oh, just like let it sink in. But it felt good. Hey, we can use infested ick to keep the toxin off you. So, what do we do now? So I'm just gonna turn off the music in my headphones. It's kind of distracting. Here we go. Uh, fuck! And we're back again. That's all that you loud. Oh. Oh, we just have to kill everything. Okay, okay, okay. 
Hey, is that a mech? Let's see, how does it feel not get getting everything immediately? I love it. I really, really love it. Because, um, like, it gives me the sense of, like, childish awe, in a sense. It's kind of like, you know, everything is like, wow, 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 that sort of feeling, you know? Like, I'm, like, the more, like, like I'm already starting to make sense of this world, and that kind of sucks, because during, like, dur like, it's not bad, but, like, during the quest, I had no idea what was going on. I had no idea what anything meant. I had no idea where I was. I, like, I didn't realize I was in the open world and, and went into the hub area at all. And because of that, like, you have this sensation of, like, you're just experiencing everything, and, like, everything is, like, oh, oh boy, oh, boy, oh, boy. Now, 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 like, I'm recognizing things, like, okay, so bounties are very much like bounties in the Plains Wide Long, and, like, I've done many of those. Bounties are very much like the, the bounties in the in, in Petruna. But still, like, the open world is so new to me that, like, I don't know what everything does. I don't know, like... I don't even know what animals look like that I need to hunt. I don't know, like, I've seen some fish fly around, but I don't know what the best spots are to hunt the fish and all that sort of stuff. And this right here, the full, I've never done a full, and everything is so new to me now. Like, I'm just like, okay, so I'm defeating enemies. Well, what is this place? So, yeah. Another thing you might need, uh, another thing you might need an art gun. Uh, I might have one on me. I barely use them, like, ever, because, like, they're always, like, so unwieldy. But we'll see how things go. So far, we're still, we're still holding up quite well. The toxicity is below 100%, at absolutely 0%. So hey, that's good. And all the resources I need to farm and that sort of stuff. There we go, we got more stuff, we got more shit. I don't know what it all means, but we'll see. <laughs> is this one of those... Infested boys? Like, I wonder. Also, like, what are these blood effects? Like, sometimes I get, like, these blood effects on, um, uh, on my screen. I don't think I have a status effect during that time, so... Sometimes these things happen as well. <laughs> I don't know what it means, but it's so cool. The Entrati ruins are close. Keep pushing, and you will be there in no time. Alright, I reach the Entrati ruins. Alright, let's go. Oh, 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 nope, nope, there hold on. Oh, hey, we got one. So, so, that thing just one shot at me, like, the in the quest. So, I'm really sure curious how we're gonna fight it. You, um, Chip. also, do we just go down here? Is that the way we do With it? Both arms disabled, the Necromech is still 40% ah, no! Do not stop attacking. Guys, hold on, I have no idea where I am. <laughs> save some, save some of the fun for me. Come on, where where do I need to go? Where do I go? Where do we go? Here we go, this way. Corrosion, your warfare is being corroded by the toxins. The marks are of uh, official re re representation. Okay. Alright, so let's see and uh, pick things up. I really like the characters. Dude, the world is very well set up and very well built out. Um, like, I, like, I have such... Like there, like I have such a feeling that so much can happen, and the, like if if it if it's even remotely what I think it is, because like this setup has been so well done. Like I just feel like, dude, I re I really want to put like all my effort into like getting the family back to remembering their names, so, like fixing up the heart of Demos, uh, like do all that shit, uh, and I can't wait for the story to get there. But, yeah, have fun doing the puzzle. I puzzle? Are we doing a puzzle? Oh, fuck me. <laughs> fuck me! I don't know what- well, okay, I have no idea. I'm just gonna let other people, like, lead the- lead the way here. Ooh, the orientation matrix. That can get me standing. Which Whatever is good. Whatever the cephalites have become, there's no going back. Hmm... Now, let's see here. Do we have to follow him? Protect Lloyd and Otak. Okay. Where is he? I don't know where he is. There's so much going on. That, that that's one thing with Infested is like 
battles are so like you have no idea what's going on because most of the time like things are just exploding and like being infested and spory and all that stuff. You gotta find out what's protecting them and then take your shot. All right, I'm just gonna be on protect duty. Uh, I'll see what other people are doing. Where? Oh, they've done here. So does he activate the generators? Let me let me pay close attention to what he does. What are you doing? Yes, he is activating the generators. Okay, makes sense. And we're getting glassmaker stuff. Surprising. Did you replay the opening tutorial? Because it's impressive. I have not done that. Um, today has been uh, has been like a, a busy day, a really good day. Like I like. You might know that like I get super excited when I when I get things done that I want to get done. So uh, today has been like an insanely good day. Like not only did I get my workout in, not only did I get like my practice in. Uh, I also uh, was able to record the Warframe playthrough, so the Warframe quest. Uh, I'm streaming right now, which makes me really, ha really happy. I was able to get Terraria video out, um, which means that we now, with the Framecast, have three videos out in uh, three days, which makes me really happy. Um, and yeah, so like it's been like a, a long, busy day. Um, I'm probably gonna try and like do a do a do a video about that like next week. Because I think it's a quest that might be worth the play. Okay, power's on. Now we gotta use that code on the door. All right, what do we do now? We turn on the generators. I'm just gonna follow him. I think that he's gonna he's gonna do something. So did you play the? I, like I'm Mika, I'm gonna assume that you played it because so you saying that's a impressive. Kind of, I think you played it. How long is it, by the way? Like, I'm surprised. I just, I just learned that like Force Press comes like still is a thing in the game. I thought that that would be replaced entirely. Cordy says, "Oh, I fell asleep. Ah, oh, I need to just wake it up in the morning." Ah, oh, damn it! <laughs> do you have to be somewhere? Do you have somewhere to be, or can you just like, do you have like time to uh, relax? Because like it's bad if you fall asleep while uh, while having somewhere to be. But like if you, if you, if you can do, if you can do whatever, it's fine. If you have the time to uh, to enjoy your rest, then that's good. Also, let me see how I'm gonna adjust the music like this. Can we push him? I don't think so. Oh shit, my Helios is dead. Damn it! Who's gonna scan things, scan things now for me? A maximum of three errors are permitted before the fail right. safe Thing X seals the vault. Do not simply guess. X blop da da. Ladies and gentlemen, please have your attention. X blop. I wanted to watch the stream, but chill vibes is too much. Some of the knowledge that was and there we go. Uh, I would argue a little, uh, a little too good. It raises the bar for the rest of the game. I like that. I really like that. Oh, and here we get everything in here. Oh my God, this fault is lo 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 loaded. Freaking loaded this fault is. Damn. It takes about 20 minutes. Did I hear workout without me? Well, JK probably. Yeah, like, like I can't work out together with anyone because of COVID. You know. The new tutorial is the same, but on a, on the open world where you go to the set and do force prize. Ooh, interesting. Like the cinematic style looks looks very interesting. Um, but yeah, I wanted to watch the stream, but chill vibes was a little bit too much. Hey man, like if the, if the stream is so relaxing that like you fall asleep to it, like I'm not even mad. Like that's really nice, you know. I just want to have a relaxing place to be. A fun place to be. And if you feel so comfortable with the stream that you're falling asleep to it, hell for me, man. Uh, I stayed up late compulsively working on a drawing. Turned out, um, turned out, though. So, uh, so, uh, let's see. We're turned out, though. So happy about that. I'm gonna assume that it turned out well. So, and you're happy about that. So, hell yeah, that's great to hear. 
Also, where do we get out? Don't think we get out there. Up here, I can go up here. So, like sometimes, like when when you're running around in areas that you're unfamiliar with, like so, like looking at these other squad mates can be like, how the hell are they so freaking fast? I have no idea how this looks like, but like they're so freaking fast. Um, what's this right here? Wake mother. Oh, so like we have mother like located for displays because of oh, that's, that's interesting. Yeah, it turned out well as desired. Uh, it being super late. <laughs> um, let's go this way. There we go. I'm starting to get a bit more orientation and feel for this place, which is good. Bada bing, bada boom. Here we are. Inside. A place with all the things that we got. Boom. Woo! Oh, man. Let's see what we all got. We got Nightwave sounding. I don't really care about all that. What I care about is what do we get? Miso 10. We got a bunch of things. And we got that. We got Foam Residue. Oh, we got the Spinal Core sections. We can rank up, I think. I'm pretty sure we can't rank up now. Oh, that fall was absolutely worth it. I nicknamed the Entrati the Diglett family. <laughs> I can see that. I can definitely see why. Yes. They're definitely the Diglett family. Also, they can move. Uh, the new frame looks really nice, too. I haven't seen it yet. Because, like, I'm not a partner anymore. <laughs> Actually, no, I don't want to. I don't want to do this uh, and try stunning. Perhaps. Rank up. There we go. You wish Continue. to negotiate? Very well. All right. What do we have here? We have pistol. We have. The tunes infestation with in the clarity. Okay, which one would you recommend my pick? Adapt to infestation, grand po proto shield resistances. Like I'm considering either like the weapon or like what are these? Like are these things even worth it? I'm trying to figure out what they are. Get a lure. Like, I'm like, I, like, most of the time, like, the, the higher lures are better, but I can grab one. Let's go for one. Lures are reusable. Okay, let's go for it then. This, mm. this specimen is a descendant of my original collection. What the fuck? How, how did... Promise you won't yell at me. You didn't incinerate them at all. You... Dump them in the exocrine. We can rebuild. They're still out there, and doing quite well, it seems. I wanted to wound you, not maim. You're right to hate me. No, I deny you my hatred. Find something else to feed on. Whatever you've become, I am still your sister. You are more. I see that now. I name you Kaylee, Water Scourge. Interesting. Oh boy, we get we get little 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 set of max little progression while we do this. Okay, actually this gets me more excited to like do do the entire thing. Oh, that's sweet. Honestly, like I was not expecting character progression like this. This is oh yeah. Okay, okay, I like it. Very well. Which is an anti jazz are for new companions. System. Also, both birds you get at this rank are for the new companions. Nice siblings being siblings. <laughs> yep. Oh wow. Okay, let's take a look at the bounties that she has. Ten out of ten best in the kitchen rank up. Oh, willingly. it's so worth it. They accepted the risks. Um and now very well then. Let's go yes. take a look at um Grab Mother, how many standing we can redeem. 
That was really surprising. I was not expecting that either. Trade tokens for stunning. Um, let's roll them in. Confirm. 5,000 stunning. Redeem. Yes, please. Thank you, dear. Very kind. How close are you get are you to getting Helmuth? I have not even looked at that. Like I have not even looked at like the Helmuth thing. I don't even know like what the process of getting it. I have only been like like right now I'm just purely focused on that, but we can go back um to take a look at the Helmuth. Exit the thing. Let's go back to the ship. Let's go take a look. Let's go take a look. <laughs> so I think you got it from Sun. Oh, how many Frank for re? All right. Well, let's go take a look. Um, I first want to go into like the helmet place, just see how, whether it has changed or not, and then um, we'll see if we're wrong. Helmet is rank free, and then height sign is the least exciting thing in my opinion. Yeah, to be honest, like I don't care too much. Master. What is up, my dude? Hop, 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 hop. Yeah, so... It's just gonna be a rank for- we're gonna rank up anyway, but let's, let's go take a look at this one then. Your pets can interact with the mouth. Really? Ah, sheed. Can you- can you feed them? <laughs> can I feed the pet? Follow me. Kitty cat, follow me. Follow me. Follow me. Follow me. Follow me. Come on, kitty cat. Come on. Follow me into this room. Follow me. Follow me. Follow me. Say hello. Say hello to Big Mouth. Come on. Come on. Come on. Kitty cat. Kitty cat. No, no, no. Don't leave me. Don't, 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 no. No. How dare you? Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Ah. Okay. Well, it doesn't look good. All right. Let's go. Uh, let's go back to to the place right here. Let's go to the mouth and press the prompt, and they will interact. Operator, did you hear that? It said. Cosmic I don't see a prompt in the mouth. So. This is just a petting thing. And I kind of teleported us to a completely different place. <laughs> I think I'm going to have to activate it first or something. Come on, kitty cat. Follow me. No, that's just... That's just... This petting scene makes no sense. Like, it just teleports us to, like, to, like a different place in the orbiter. The meridians away the final pentatonic. Ah, but I can't open anything. All right, well, let's, uh... The Kefat needs to be near. He was right next to it! Come on, Kefat. Come on, kitty cat. Let's engage with it. Get it close. Get it close. I also don't get this camera angle. It's like, you barely see anything. No! Don't leave. Come with me. Follow me. Follow your owner. I'm not about to, like, experiment on you. Definitely not. I would never! I want to get a leash. <laughs> Alright, fuck this. <laughs> I'm, uh, I'm gonna go back, um, and get some more stunning. This is, uh, this is a scheme to give your, uh, confetti pets. It's a scheme to let me sacrifice, uh, my, um... My key is my pets to to the big mouth in the back of my ship. But hey, I'm down with it. Stop trying to feed a cat to the uh, the cafeta helmet. Why should I not? Give me one good reason why I should not. Because I think it's pretty good. Alright, let's see here. Um, grandmother right here. Don't need to go to grandmother. Actually, this right here. Oh, this is father with like the kick, um, kick ons thing. Nafidia, what's up, dude? How's it going, Misha? I'm quite alright. I'm really, really, really enjoying this update. How about you? How are you doing? Um. Browsewares. Let's see here. Requires friend. Requires friend. Oh, she punished me for it. I desired only solitude, and for that, she made me scapegoat. I don't see the helmet in here yet, but we'll see. 
Um, I shall languish. Uh, because, uh, let's see. Because uh, I won't give you the good touch if you do. I still want to get. I want. I want to feel Mike Fat. Uh, I still. I still, still want to. I still want to put Mike Fat to to that thing and see how it interacts. The Cubra will play with the mouth, and the Fat will get eaten and girthed out. Ooh, that is nice. Are you looking for the modular pets? I'm looking for like pretty much anything right now. Um, basically, uh, like most of what I'm doing is like trying to get bounties and shit. Um, because. Um, like, those are the things which are most straightforward, and, like, I am, I'm, I'm coming from a very, 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 very busy day, so, uh, there is a lot, a lot of, like, new, uh, of new things coming at me, uh, and I don't, don't think that I have all the mental capacity to, like, do very, very complicated stuff right now, uh, but bounty should be pretty straightforward, so I want to go down the bounty list, and then after that, like, we'll see whatever we're gonna do, uh, but anyway, if anyone wants to join in, like, let me know, or on PC right now. Go to the sun and look for the first two options to see how the pet pets work. I've taken a quick look at it. Like, if I find one fire, like, conservation, like, I can take it in and I can use it to, like, save it or something. The infestation um, has covered them now. But yeah, like, um, again, it's like, well. I've had, like, I've been up since, what is it, 530? Which has been, like, I've been up for about... Lloyd can give you the details. What is it? <laughs> 21 minus 6. 21 minus 6. 15 and a half hours now? Yesterday was like a 20 hour day. <laughs> um so I I'm gonna I'm gonna look those things up, but first first doing gonna do these things. Just pull the trank rifle out. Just uh this thing if I find them. Try and break open the box again! Oh shit, this is one of those uh, things that you say I should, uh... I don't know what that does, I don't know what the benefit of that is, but we did something. Uh, also I should probably get towards my, uh, my teammates. Oh, from what I know, uh, you just make the free parts and slap them together with a crazy with crazy glue, and then like, what do you get? Because like, I just built that tower with my with my uh, hand parts from my from my Tenno, and now I'm quite curious as to like what what. what... Oh my God, this is just straight up rip from uh, Planes of Wide though. <laughs> from all the beautiful design, this thing is just straight up from Planes of Wide Okay. Oh boy, did you just use the cash to? Uh, they give buff or debuff to the enemies. Oh, interesting. Only in that area, or like across the entire like instance. Researcher Latrox has agreed to assist our reclamation efforts. Please protect him while he conducts the necessary survey. Tenno. Oh, we gotta protect the researcher. Interesting. Like I like I I like these um, story beats a lot more. Oh, also because they're new. Only in the circle. Okay. I'm gonna have to. What a I was expecting to get my head beaten off at any moment. While you're here, can you help I'm gonna have to like keep by my uh, my arc wing again. Just a few, and then wait. <clears throat> I swear. That ugly one just coughed up what we're after. Alright, we gotta go and find some samples. Perfect. Now we need to grab some more samples. Just to be sure. More samples! Let's see, the cash is Grenier type, so since Mars is Grenier. <laughs> I wouldn't even classify this as Grenier, but yeah, Mars is Grenier. But like, wasn't this like, wasn't like the story that this thing was just like, um, very much out of space and now got pulled into Mars because like the heart kind of stopped or sort of, sort of thing? So like, this isn't really Mars. Like, this is a, this, this has become like a, an orbiting planet moon type thing of Mars. There is, uh, there is, there is now a 69 Necrolisk. Ooh, anything with 69 on that, I, uh, I want to have. First in the game. Also, I really like these, the design of these enemies. Like, oh, they're so good. Like, they're just like these, you know, these little, like, insect things. Oh, 
Like, already, like, in real life, they have, like, this weird... Ah, oh, fuck, I went to the button again. Uh, the Grenier Corpus are also on Davos Open World Zed Life. Yeah, we're, we're defending a Corpus Researcher right now. Which, I mean, it makes so much sense, because, like, the, like, the... The, the Infested are just, like, such a plague. That, obviously... Like, at this point, like, it doesn't really matter. Like, you're kind of, like, in this together. What the fuck? What killed me? I need to see this. I can't even see what killed me. Interesting. Oh yeah, when you go back to base, uh, go to the hallway left of modern and go into operator mo uh, mode, a new path will open. Oh yeah, we, we went down there in a moment, but I'm gonna have to drop off some new modules, because oh my god, that is the best place ever. Uh, I want to have my mecha. Tyrannus! What is up, dude? How's it going, man? So I can see, dude. The Corpus also worked for the Orokin. Yeah, they did. That is true. Upload all data. Data uploaded. That's it, one of them is down. Got him. Woke up to three giant worms? What killed me? Uh, I mean, have a guess, but I, I, I didn't see them attack me. Like, that was a weird thing. Like, nor normally, like, you're, you're having, like, a couple of, uh... You have a couple of, like, like hits that you that come in. And then you, like, you know where it's coming from. What the fuck? What killed me? The teal, the earth, the steel path, and the demon, the demon. Oh, shit. Yeah, I haven't tried, like, I haven't tried to steal path here yet. Oh, interesting. Come on, we need more data upload. Oh my god! Stop! I want. Well, why couldn't we get more data upload? I started just in time. Fuck! I wanted to get that bonus so badly. Uh, foam, is, foam is new lord. Oh, these these things are insane. I wonder if we ever get to fight them like uh, Eidolon type things. Large predatory organism in the, the steel path bounty is the most fun bounty. Before we can reclaim the base, use bait to lure it out. Well, we should try it. In order to proceed, you will now need to gather materials. Gather materials. What is this, Fortnite? Fewer, uh, let's see, fewer infested aggro now. Not with Nidus. I mean, can you, like, can you do this with anything else other than Nidus? You need to kill things uh, during the upload. That's what counts. What causes the counter to go up? Oh, I thought it was just protecting him. I thought that was the entire meme. It's like protect me, and I'll upload everything. And the moment like I get hurt, then like I'll stop thinking, doing the thing. Oh, here we have fish. Oh fuck. Fuck. Fish! I keep forgetting these fish like flow above. Wait, why did I not get the fish? I thought I hit a fair and square. Fishy, fishy. Why did I not get fish? Fish! This is so weird. Nice fishing rod. I'm trying to uh, I'm trying to catch a fish, but they don't let themselves be caught, and then they disappear. I still need to get used to the flying fish things. All right, let's go around here. Oh my god, what is this? Some sort of like face eater? Oh, new enemy design. I love it. Use the poe rods. Okay, I'll try that. Let's see where I have them. Do I still have them on here? No, I don't think so. Roll to remove them. Okay, I thought my I thought my uh, my tactical so was uh, quite clever. Oh, 
of turning into Tenno mode and then shooting my warframe. You can also swap rods when uh, using one while holding any rod. Okay, hold on. Ah, don't want to go into chat. Let's see. Giggity for holding rods. <laughs> Uh, let's see here. So, just a regular fishing spare. Where are fishies? There were like a bunch of them a moment ago. Not here. Ah! S stay still. Nice and quiet. Oh, there we go. Okay, yeah, that worked. Fortuna Rod works for me. It looks like a bug frame. Yeah, like they work for the, they work with the with the um, um with the quest. Start in future. It might be the wrong cure for Tuna Rod too. I'm just assuming. Uh, let's see. Um, P O E rods are constantly swapped like uh are swapped like bait. Um, they're all constantly equipped these days. Yeah, like I know that they that they made that thing. Uh, I just need to like reset my gear wheel and like work on it because like a lot of Warframe like hasn't been optimized like in a long time because like I've moved things around for uh, recordings for like Xenos videos, um, and then because I haven't played, I didn't play it for a long time. Like most of this just like is still like very much out of shape. So I need to I need to increase my efficiency again. I'm too inefficient for playing Warframe currently. Oh my god, Deimos Juggernaut! If the infested are eliminated too far from the vessel, this will not work. Oof. That's no good. You gotta bother Brad, what's up, dude? He do be wecking, uh, he do be fracking, he do be eating, but most of all, he be deleting. For Trinam Road, it's never worked on PE, PoE fish, except the, the, uh, the stun. Did it not work? To fulfill mission parameters. I thought they did. And uh, 21 blood tokens, fuck yeah. But Brand, how's it going, man? How are you doing? Some of the fish are pure Orokin ones, so the Fortuna Rod will work on them, and possibly the hybrid ones, but pure infested one needs the plane draw or the Deimos Rod. Okay. That's good to know. I also like how easy they are to catch, you know? Because, like, they're kind of like, they're just, like, swimming around. Like, you can just grab them. You don't have to, like, go to a lake and stand by the lake and wait on the lake. Once I reactivate the dormant elements, the infested will attempt to prevent completion of the process. Alright, let's go here. Uh, I'm doing good. I'm Tenerife on vacation. Dude! That is, uh, that's pretty neat. How is it? What's the weather like? It's been, like, super, super hot weather, like, lately. Uh, but, uh, today was, like, the first big storm day. And, oh, boy, was the big storm. Like, trees fell down, that sort of stuff. Um... And like, it's so nice to be inside during that, but like, if you have to go out, like, it really sucks. Uh, sadly, can't play the new update. Ah, oh, dude, it's it's really good. It's like, surprisingly good. It's the complete opposite of Railjack. Like, at least to me, like, I really didn't like Railjack. And this is like, I, I can't even imagine it came out of, the same, out of the same studio. I cannot imagine it. It's so good. So, yeah. It's funny that when Fast is awake, the Infested turned purple, and when Foam is up, the Infested turned pink. I, I hadn't even noticed that, to be honest. I really hadn't. That being said, though, I like I love the color design. I really love like the, the aesthetic. I think that for like an open world, the Infested theme works so good. I think Infested theme first, then like Fortuna, and then Poe. Like those are probably my favorites in terms of like like aesthetic and like places to be in. Hot weather. I thought you were more Norton. Uh, yeah. I mean, nor normally, normally like this this, this, this this Holland doesn't really get that hot, you know. But like we just had a we just had a heat wave. For the last while. Also, do we need to take these down? Is this a thing that we need to do? Do we have to fight them? Oh! Oh, so last week got myself some emotes done. Ooh, sweet! Nice, dude! That is awesome! It's Hotland now! No, they're on your side. Okay. I felt like maybe if I, if I beat them, then like, I get some parts from them and I can turn it into... Into into like standing so that I can get more so I can milk, build my own type of type of meme, you know. It's 
I really want my Omeka. Uh, I've played with it once, I want more. So Tyrannus, have you played the, 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 the quest already? And the mechs are allies depending on location and cycle if I recall correctly. Ah, oh, that's so confusing now. I'm sure in about like a week or so I'll know exactly like when they're good and when they're bad, but right now I'm like... Okay, that sounds a little bit confusing. Alright, let's get back. Let's get back to the big pulsating bowl of safety or something. It's so weird, like, like this bowl type of thing is like where like the heart is and where like infestation should be like the... Where we fight it sort of thing, but yeah. Etzels are safe heaven. Yep, did it last night. Spend uh, today farming resources. How? Wh what do you think? What did you think of the quest? How do you like it? We've got signals singing the same song as our victim. Oh, Careful. someone is doing a uh, night wave. I think we're not waiting for them. Okay, the gigantic ball sack. The gigantic, the, the, the guy, gigantic ball sack with like the opening buttholes as caves. It's it's again beautifully Warframe, beautifully Warframe made. Big nuts, uh, big nuts out of whack. <laughs> oh boy. Oh, by the way, have you guys been getting, uh, been getting uh, Twitch drops? Like, I don't know if you guys are locked into Warframe, but like, let me know what kind of things you got, because I don't think I've got many Twitch drops. Like, actually, I should check my inbox. <laughs> the area is weird. Come back. Uh, I guess like everyone's waiting, so like. Quest was a decent introduction one, interesting lore implications. I definitely feel so too. Like, I like, I felt like there was a lot in there. Like, it was, like, it was longer than I ever anticipated. It was more engaging, and I was like, so, like, it didn't feel, like, it didn't feel like it was prolonged. It didn't feel it was short and more rush. It was perfect length for, like, introducing, like, the family and, like, the family therapy thing. But, like, I just hate it when it was done because I knew there was so much more that still need to get done. I was hoping that we could like get these things done, but I hopefully like through uh, all the things like the the stuff like um, all the things like ranking up and all that sort of sort of things. Like hopefully we're gonna we're gonna get that fixed. I uh, didn't get my drops yet. Oh shit! Um, but if Blue Demon got seven drops, you should be getting drops on all Warframe streams. Like the drops are enabled according to Twitch, so then there might be something wrong with your uh, with your setting. Um, I'm not quite sure, but uh, I'll take a look in a moment. I don't know if I can get drops from my own stream, but we'll see. Um, let's see. Actually, we've done mother. Actually, what were our last mission results? I like that. Like the, 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 oh my god, I, I love the old layout. Stats? No, I wanna like I, I like. It's nice and all, but like this is really, really like not clear. I really like the old layout because it was like a lot more on top. I don't care. I don't care about seeing the, the faces. I don't give a fuck. Give me all the stats, please. This is really nice when like when you rush through. Um, but uh, yeah. Anyway, um, what do we have here? We have fishes. Um, we got things. I don't even know what we got. Teshin won't stop. I'm I'm on drop thirty. Teshin won't stop emailing me. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. <laughs> All right, let's go and uh, hand in our uh, our things. Old layout was better. I think so too. Uh, like, I, I wish you could switch between them, because the the new layout is nicer We're if you just want to like to run through. Because like, if it pops up, it only pops up like halfway, so you can just like dismiss it and go through with it, while while the other one is like fully in your face. But when it comes to when it comes to like actually like, trying to get information out of it, it's kind of bad. Uh, this is 5,000. I probably don't want to use that. Ah, shit. Deshin is, des is a desperate boyfriend slash daddy, and now SMH, how the great have fallen. Oh, yeah. Ah, uh, Deshin, Deshin has lost so much ground. Alright, so we should do another fold. Because um, then we get another one of these things, and then we can um, rank up there. Also, I should find grandmother's son right here. No, I should find grandmother to get our mother right here. No, grandmother, I need to get our standing up. Because I think I'm about to like get some standing here. Oh, that is much, much better and easier to use, definitely. Like, I feel, I feel with many of the, the recent UI updates, like, they, they just, they're just, like, more form over function type thing. 
And like, I'm not that happy about that. So, uh, let's redeem all we can, all we can. Let's oh, proceed. Magnificent. Go on, dear. So, how far are we? We're still quite good. A grandmother token. A rare sign of grandmother's favor. How, oh, how, how can we get grandmother's favor? Help. Exchange family Let's tokens. You and I have a chin wag. Oh. Okay. This is interesting. So, 10 mother tokens. Is this worth it? Uh... So based on Pablo's tweet, who are who are we gonna be dating this stream? What is about Pablo's tweets? I have not seen. I've not seen them, so I don't know. Explain to me. Yeah, is this worth it? I'm I'm wondering about the calculation. As you wish. It probably will be. I'll be right here gathering dust. Ah. Together, All right, let's do another fold. We pacify this moon. I do appreciate one who is not afraid of a little. Pablo said the, old, uh, the the update was a dating sim. Much was it? From us on Demos. Okay, that's. Uh, I haven't really noticed that yet. It's it's more like family therapy session. Inside, like that's what it is. Because like this is a one broken hell family, not just in health but also like in communication. Um. Let's see. Uh, grandmother's tokens are worth 1.5k standing, so Much it's efficient for standing, but since you need other tokens for ranking up, I don't really recommend it. Okay. Pixel, what's up, dude? How's it going? Misho, so I'm curious about something. Given the active uh, role chat sometimes takes in your podcast, why don't you do a chat overlay to include the chat in the recording so that later viewers know what's up? Um, the reason why is because, like, generally, um, like, um, uh, the reason why we don't have a chat overlay in the podcast is because, like, uh, the idea of the podcast is to, like, give a um, podcast experience. Like, the the most ideal thing, which, like, we went for it in the beginning, was to just have a discussion and not many distractions, like, with chat and that sort of stuff. Um, I do think, though, with, like, the, the, the way that Framecast has turned out, the Framecast started out as, like, a discussion platforms like the podcast was about like a singular topic and we were going to go in depth about it and like discuss it a lot so like let's say uh when we were talking about like arcwing like why is why like why what why is the arcwing problem like we would go in depth about it because we talked about it for two hours that changed um so right now like it's more of a like we do some topics or like it's more like um it's more freestyle type thing um however i still like the uh like the um, Hold on, where are they getting in? I am really confused right now. Hold on, I'll get back to you in a second. I need to I need to figure out where I need to go. Because that place where we where we're going seems to be on the ground. Oh no, they're up ground. Okay, that's good. Alright, so. Um let me get back to let me get back to the start because I don't know what I said. Um okay, so first of all, the framecast started out as a um a debate show type thing. Because um say no I like because I know I love doing podcasts, and he was a good debater, um, and I kind of like hated it, um, the thing that like there there were a lot of topics within Warframe at that point, um, where um, where things would only be discussed uh, be discussed like very very surface level. So like when it came to like the log instance, people would be like, oh I hate it, like it's bad because like other people will be able to get my center star. Oh I hate it because or I love it because I will be able to get the center star. And like what we said with like the the nerves of um, like what Sandy was talking about yesterday with the nerves of uh, certain weapons, like how it was only like uh, described like what's the, what are the current stats, not like what are their intentions, like where do they go. Like a lot of times, like these things aren't discussed because people don't take the time to discuss. And it's really tough to like discuss that in depth when we have like a chat situation going on because like I can speak and I I'm encouraged to speak all the time because that's the way that Twitch works. Like I'm encouraged to speak and then like let chat play and then me read out a chat and then like based on that. Like do my discussion, sort of, sort of thing. But like, it doesn't really work as like a great discussion. That's where Framecast was born with that idea. And with that idea in mind, like, we just wanted to have like a one-on-one -on -one discussion. We didn't want to have that many distractions. I wanted to have like a podcast experience where it's like, hey, we, we're having a discussion, and like, if chat sometimes like comes forward and like we take use of it, then like we can go with it. Now that format has changed. We've decided to include like a wider variety of topics. Like we've moved away from just Warframe, uh, and because of that, like. Um, it's become a little bit more loosely structured, and I know that Drew likes to take from chat, and like, I also don't think it's bad. Like, I really like, like, see, like the interaction a little bit, but I still, like, I still like it more as a podcast on its own. Um, 
Because the thing is, with a Twitch chat, like, I, I save these Twitch chats right now. Uh, I, I record all of them, and, like, I save them for, like, later reference in case I need them for videos, in case I need them for, like, hey, how have I changed over time sort of thing. Uh, and with that, like, it's really fun to, like, see Twi Twitch streams, but they're only, like, really, really fun live. Because Twitch streams and, like, things that are in folks on chat are really, like, engaging if you're watching that live, because then you can, like, engage with the chat. Otherwise, like, oh, yeah, I can see what chat was doing, but, like, I'm not part of it. So, like, I don't want the podcast to be focused on chat. The moment you put the chat in their overlay, then people are gonna assume that like the chat plays a part of it. Like then they're gonna assume that like oh we're gonna res like we're gonna respond to you right away. We're gonna break up our discussion for your comments, and that's not what I wanted to be. Uh, because then like the the podcast suffers on the fact that it's live. Because then like we're gonna have to like stop our discussion, halt or the thing that we're talking about, because something has been put in chat and we need to respond to that. That's not what I wanted the podcast. Uh, that being said, though, like I do really like the, the life element, like like you saw yesterday with uh, with Sandy, um, like Chad can often like give in uh, very interesting points of view, which like otherwise wouldn't have been brought up. And as long as they're brought up by, hey, I just see that someone says like, oh, someone in chat uh, brought up this point, and you like you read at the point. Like I don't see much difference between me bringing up like the point like organically and me bringing up that point like someone in chat said. So I hope that like for like. Watching it, like rewatching it, like it, it doesn't deteriorate from the rewatch value. So like that's kind of like my reason behind it, if that makes sense. <laughs> um, so yeah, you can collect uh, tokens to build up standing as you please run. I have to play missions every day. Yes, I, uh, uh, I discovered that. Like that is so cool. I really like that thing. I really, really like that. Um, because that was one of the big problems like last year or like when Fortnite released. That like. People wanted to farm day one, and like they couldn't because they would reach their cap, and I was like, ah oh, shit, now I gotta stop, and this works pretty well. I like it. Um, the mission you're doing at the moment is really good for resource farming, uh, FGI? Okay, cool. I mean, like, I figured because, like, if I, 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 I like, I'm not, like, actually, I figured it's the wrong way to say it. Like, that makes sense to me because the last time that I was into that cult, like, there were so many resources there. Um, so yeah, that's pretty cool. So yeah, um, let's see, Gut Chat started as an interview, and obviously Chat can't be allowed to pull the spotlight away from the interviewee. Yeah, because then it's like, if, if, if Chat becomes prominent, it becomes a life experience, and I don't have a problem with a life experience, like you can also have like a podcast type deal with like a life experience, but then you can't like release it as a podcast. Because then like, the felt like there's a lot of value lost, like this stream, for example, like I could not release this as like a like a like a gameplay episode. Like I've tried like, like I'm trying something right now. So, like today I released a video on Terraria, um, which included large segments of like what we did on Twitch. Uh, because I want to see if I can combine like um, like YouTube and Twitch in, in scenarios like Minecraft or Terraria, like where we're playing through games which require a lot of like extra farming and grinding and like creative input from like you guys or like me or whatever. So like Minecraft isn't a story game which you can play through in like a series where it's like, oh yeah, we're just like going to, we're going to do eight episodes and we've done Minecraft. Like a lot of Minecraft's fun comes from actually like building things and like going through like a lot of grind and like farming a lot of resources. And that's something which is a lot of fun to do in stream. So like I'm trying to see whether we can like combine YouTube and Twitch for these types of media. So like it's like if you do something like Terraria or Minecraft or like another like world building stream, Subnautica or something. Uh, where like you do like the story beats on YouTube, so like if someone wants to follow along the story on YouTube, then like uh, they can have that experience very well. But you can also like do it on Twitch and do like the grinding stuff and like uh, some of the, like fun idea stuff on, uh, on, on 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 the live stream, and then you can include those in the video. I don't know how well it work out will work out because it's the very first time I'm trying it. Um, however, the thing is getting back to the point of like why Twitch streams don't work, uh, like like well why Twitch streams only work live. It's like, if I put this into a video right now, like, this entire discussion spawned off of, like, Piranha asking me about, like, the, the chat overlay on, um, uh, what is it, on, uh, Framecast. And, like, I'm responding to that, and then, like, you guys, like, if you're like, oh, hey, like, I just want to ask a question about that, like, I'm obviously, uh, like, I'm definitely, like, gonna jump back on, like, what you do, what you, what, what you're gonna say, and then, like, gonna continue on with, the, like, what I say from there. It's like, that's, like... That's the that's the thing of, of it being live and me interacting with chat. I love it. I really love it. I love it. Cool. But like that's the element of it being live, where it's like, hey, you know, you can interact right now, and you can, you can like 
modify what's happening, and that's why they be like put up with me, it's like not planning my comp in the head, but me just like being reactive in that sense. Um, and that doesn't work with the video because you'd lose that entire like life. So yeah. Um, let's see. Um, putting chat in it also means people won't be able to put it on the background because they'll be needing to pay attention to chat. Yep. And I really love my podcast to just like play them as like radio shows. So. Yep. Um. Oh, by the way, this mission has free available cycles so long as you uh, stay inside it uh, and DS it, nothing about it. Um, if you stay in your instance and trigger the bounty two more times after the first, you get better and different drops. Oh shit! self assigned tasks are and uh, emergent fun. Um, it can be, depends on the game. So that's really cool to know. Uh, right now, like today, has been a really busy day. So like my 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 mental focus capacity on like learning new things and figuring out all the tactics is like kind of low. Um, so like I'm not gonna implement that today, but that sounds really cool, and it's definitely something which I'll be probably willing to try tomorrow. Actually, like uh, I'm kind of wondering. Like tomorrow is gonna be it tends to be like a YouTube uh, stream day, um, and I really want to continue with Temtem, but I'm kind of wondering like should we continue with Temtem? Like would we not? Oh my God, it's dying! Where where, where is our Where's our thing? Where's our Where's our guy? Guys, what are we doing? Fuck off! Get it! Get to him! Get to him! Get to him! Where is he? It's such a job. Oh, there he is! I found him. System failure imminent. Void energy recharge essential. Ah! Ah! He almost died. Ah! Shit. Yeah, it is the liberty of the sign, but it's not onboarded anywhere in the game. They thought parties were going to stick together after one mission. <laughs> Ow. Yeah, that rarely happens. You can heal them with the operator's E, by the way. Oh shit, I didn't know that. Where is he? Oh, he's already here. So you, sh you should, like... Tell us where you are! So that we can protect you better. So yeah. Well, how do you get like the frame cast yesterday, Pixel? And like anyone that was there watching the, the frame cast yesterday, how do you guys like it? Because uh, it was a little bit different than, than normal, because like normally we have topics, normally we have like, well, I mean, Sino and I uh, like prepare it. We had nothing prepared. Because uh, I was just like, the last time I did a podcast with Sandy, it turned out very well red, and we kind of like. We had too little time, we had too much to talk about, so I think we're going to be alright if we just like wing it. And winging it went quite fine. Uh, I fell, but like, I'm quite curious as to like, what you think. Uh, Pri Pixel says, it was fun! Hell yeah, I'm glad to hear that. Uh, now that I have they truly want Xeno doing, uh, doing a 24 hour heat. Oh, they want uh, Xeno to do like a 24 hour session on the, on the, on this, these planes again? Oh, that's so cool! Yeah, we should push him to do it, because like, he's... He has done one on the on the um, Fortuna one, and he's done one on the Planes by Long. So like he should do one here too, because like otherwise like, what is he doing? Now, it was fun. I just hope I don't didn't sign to hostile when uh, mentioning my opinion on things. Dude, definitely never, 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 never. Ne okay, this is one thing which I want to like make very clear here on stream. Uh, is like, never be afraid to force your opinion, because like as long as like you believe in your opinion. Or it's like most of the time you do, but like as long as like you believe in your opinion, like the, the reason why I say is like you can also just like throw out an opinion, just like stir up some drama or things. Like you can be like, oh yeah, no, I I I uh, I, I think this, you know, and you don't really believe it. It's just like that you're like, oh yeah, no, like I, I I'm saying this to like stir things up. But as long as it's like truly your opinion. Uh, by the way, X, flingy thing, uh, blob and Y and I. Oh, there we go. Um, then, like, never be afraid of stating it. Because, like, the most we can do is disagree with you, but then because, like, we're in this space where, we're like, we, you know, we talk to each other and, like, we're, we're a community here, we can, like, figure out why we have different opinions. Why this game froze, because it's literally frozen right now. Uh, and we can learn something from it. So, like, never be afraid of your opinions. Don't, don't be afraid of, like, posting them. Like, I will never take it as, like, a hostile attack on anything. If anything, like, I really love it when... Uh, when you come out with like a opinion which is like very like counteracting and it's like you're you're like trying to like fight my like um we're gonna try and find a middle ground um this is big f's in chat though because we just entered the fault 
And uh, yeah, this this is pretty dead. This is the first bug I encountered. Um, I guess it's time to time to try to call quits. <laughs> oh, fuck. Uh, yeah, Xandy's good as waffling when the air needs filling, uh, but at the same time, it's not just hot air either. Good shit. Rep, fall. Oh, man. This is so sad. I was right here. Oh, 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 it's safe. It's safe. There is there is hope after all. There is there is a god. Oh, no, host migration. There is so much more to found. Save me. Save me. Save me. Don't let me get kicked. This can still go wrong. This can still go wrong. After that long, there's no way the connection maintained. Please, please. I guess to get freeze like that when someone with a bad connection joins me. Yeah, it, it sucks that it happened at the fold. Like if it happens, like. Oh, we're still in here. Okay. Ah, uh, that's only circuits. We got—I got nothing of the resources. You see, in payday two, there is no host migration. Let's see. I need to find resources. Like get resources. Hit tab or your mission progress. No, I'm just all by myself in here. And oh, I hate this new UI. Oh, it's so bad. Anyway, let's just um, move on. Follow there is along. A necromech guarding the ruins. You will need to defeat it in order to roam with the ruins. Ah, the necromech guardian is here. All right. Hey, here. isn't this? Aren't we like going back in progress right now? Then we just do this. The Guardian of the Vault approaches. You must defeat it, Tenno. Ah, shit. How do you fight this? Is it weak to... Tenno abilities? Like, what's it weak to? That did some damage. And that's especially when the host crashed at the end of the highs. You gotta shoot the arms, okay. That is some useful advice. That's recharging hell. And now the arms are off, so. Ah, shit, there's another one. Oh, move it! Move it! Move it! Why is it- why am I so slow? Oh, come on. Come on, move it! When the arm's off, you still need to whack him there. So you still need to shoot at where the arm used to be. Am I out of ammo? No. Let's see. Yeah, the one thing I fucking hate about this update's enemy design. Do we have another one? How many of these guys are here? Come on. Ugh. All right. Fuck it. I'm leaving. Let's go to your over Fuck this. It's getting two hours in. I, th I thought we were just gonna get the full. If we're gonna have to restart us again, I'm not. I'm not down for that. Fuck that. <laughs> uh, one thing I fucking hate about something this enemy says that almost everything is weak spot based. This is not a game where where that works. We move too fast for aiming to be possible, um, uh, and requiring that is just bad juju. Actually, like I didn't even know that that was like a thing, because like I remember fighting it in game. Like I remember fighting in the quest, and it didn't even fight like that. Like, 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 like I had to fight this, this, this mecha, 
in the quest. It didn't even fight. Um, so, like, it didn't put up a fight, and I just, like, shot it. And sometimes I heard it, and sometimes it didn't. But I think I shot it with my Alamo, so I probably I hit the speed spells. But yeah, I can help you with phones in the future. Yeah, definitely, dude. Um, like, I definitely want to play some together, and I de like, I definitely want to also, like, start doing, like, uh, infights, and then we're gonna, we can, like, plan our squats and do all those, that sort of thing. But anyway, um, it's been about two hours in, I'm probably gonna go and get a rest, because, like, it's been a really, really, really long day. Um, and then tomorrow I can, like, look up some more things and get more acquainted with, uh, with the better, with the better understanding of having to go. So, yeah. Oh, man. Oh, boy. Uh, let's see. Uh, I could only fight the Necro Merc with the Art Gun. Oh, that's an interesting one. But like, I, I like launching the Art Gun would be very slow, so I would have to like get used to launching that. Anyway, um, I'm gonna go and get some things more efficiently. I'm gonna like work on my knowledge type thing. Uh, I do really enjoy it. It's been a long time since I really enjoyed oh, working like this, so that's really cool. That? Um, anyway, um, let's go take a look at who's live right now. Uh, and let's see who we can, who we can host. Um, let's see here. We have live currently, we have live Nassif with Warframe, we have live uh, Tiger Stripe with Warframe, and then... Um, ba -ba 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 Neo Ness with Warframe. So let me know what you guys want to go to. Do you guys want to go to Neo, Nassif, or Tiger? Let me know in the chat what you guys want to go to. Uh, oh, Sherpa's up! Oh shit! Hold on. Oh yeah, Sherpa's up too. So we have Sherpa, we have Neo, we have Tiger. I mean, there's so many people up. So let me know who you guys want to go to. The guy, the, the person with the most votes, we're gonna to go to. Uh, Teresa's Tiger. Uh, I think Corti. Uh, no, Pixel says a Sherpa. Um, one vote for each. Need an extra deciding vote. Need an extra deciding vote. Come on, let's go for that. Da -da -da -da. Otherwise, I'm gonna to ask to this side. Let's see. If there's someone who could do it with fewer than Sherpa. Okay, well, uh, this for, this one for Sherpa accounts double because it's shiny. I guess we're going to Sherpa then because, hey, you know, you guys are very persistent. <laughs> uh, and, like, Sherpa's a good, is a cool guy, so let's go. Also, he changed his name to Sherpa. And not, like, when did he do that? I remember when he used to be, like, Sherpa Raid. Anyway, uh, let's do the Raid thing. Raid. Sherpa. Just Sherpa. Boom, far back. Oh, I, I just never noticed it then. All right, anyway, thank you so much for tuning in. Say hi to Sherpa, he's, uh, he's a really cool guy. Uh, but yeah, oh, he's engaged now, by the way. Oh, really? Dude, that is so cool. All right, we'll say hi to him. Uh, and uh, yeah, I will see you all around for tomorrow. Uh, we might just do this stream on Twitch instead of YouTube. We'll see. See you guys around, eh?